Hi, my name is Melly Cavalier Anthony. Abelino Go. And we are the editors of this book that has just been published, Non Traditional Security Issues in ASEAN Agendas for Action. Uh, briefly, this book is a sequel to an original book that was published also on understanding what non traditional securities are and why these are important issues. To, uh, to deal with the security challenges faced by both states and societies. Dina will tell you more about the uh, contents of the book. Yes, in the book we cover eight non-traditional security issues which include climate change, food security, uh, marine environmental pollution, complex disasters, nuclear security, displaced persons, trafficking in persons, and health security. All these issues are saving challenges in ASEAN. Climate change, for example, has been identified as one of the most uh, pressing security threats in the region. And the importance of health security has been felt by all of us during the COVID-19 outbreak this year, where marine environmental issues such as marine plastic debris has received increasing attention in ASEAN. Many of these issues are interrelated and have like, transboundary effects. Climate change induces more disasters, disaster worsens and food insecurity, and threaten the security and safety of nuclear facilities in ASEAN's members. While well, public health emergencies compound uh, the challenges facing um, vulnerable groups such as uh, displaced persons and migrant workers. So how are we going to address these issues? Uh, yeah, to continue from where Lina took off, uh, really one of the thrusts of this book is to look at the responses uh, by governments and by other actors, in this case a regional organization like ASEAN and other groups, uh, civil society groups for example, and international organizations, as many of these issues really require a more comprehensive approach to it. So uh, for each challenge, whether it's health, it's uh, climate change, or it's nuclear security, we not only describe the issue, but look at how these are being addressed by the whole of society, the whole of government, and essentially all of the region approach. We hope you enjoy reading this book.